NBA championship, the 6'4 guard in his seventh season. And he was huge for the Denver Nuggets. The primary six man is getting left open in the corner. Offensive rebound, Chad Holmgren doing what he did against the Utah Jazz, putting one down. A couple of hand injuries, big absences for this Toronto team that has lost eight consecutive games as Olenek with the shot clock dwindling, and it's stripped and turns it over. SGA to a cutting Holmgren diving down the lane, and once again, he's got his second jam. How about this? That's not the trail big. That's the gravy train coming down the middle. That was a, a very fruitful play on Wednesday. All those dunks that Chet Holmgren had. He's going to go right back to it. Chet Holmgren this time with two hands. I guess the team has got a lot of guys out. You just have to ride this out. You know they're not going to stay at that clip for the entire game. Just got to be patient. And Kenrich Williams, patient on that play in the perfect spot, settles things down with the three. And they didn't fall. There's an errant pass. The pass up ahead. Dork beat everybody down the floor, but he missed the dunk. There is SGA to fire it back down to Kenrich Williams to clean it up. Whatever it takes. Awara got caught deep. And his teammate left the area. Results of the turnover. SGA spinning into the lamp, and SGA scores. That's beautiful. So he's got 13 points in the first. You see that double team. The stunt comes up. Shea spinning. Tough shot, and still able to get it up over Dick and scores. Oh, nice move to decrease that number. I've been very good at that all season and not given up those points. This is a guy who's very been good all season. <laughs> and out of bounds. Here's OKC, a little push. There is Wiggins and Aaron. Wiggins right to the rack as he flushes it down. And he tried to float again across the baseline with the left hand reverse. No good. Giddy sets it up. Kaysen Wallace from the corner, and Kaysen Wallace cans the three. Yeah, thank you, Paris. It is Canada basketball night here inside Scotiabank Arena. And both SGA and Lou Dort get a little recognition during the timeouts. As Canadians very proud of their NBA natives. As Kaysen Wallace dials up his second three, coming off the bench. Going to run a little bit of offense, trying to operate quickly. Wallace. Passed up the three. Instead, mid-range shot was at a pass to Holmgren, and Holmgren catches it and quickly turns around and guides it in for the two. And now all of a sudden, you know, we talked about just got to survive that big run by the Raptors. Well, the Thunder have survived that run. Now with a three-point lead, and it continues now up to six. And couldn't squeeze it through traffic. From trailing by 11 to up by six. There's a Toronto turnover. Giddy on the run. A little behind the back pass. Off the catch. Case and Wallace. Wiggins. Still with time here. Five on the shot clock. Wiggins right back to Holmgren. Inside and Chet Holmgren. Another dunk. And that's those transition opportunities that are taking the Raptors apart. Boy, great tie up. Josh Giddy step for step. Tops of that ball free, and it's J-Dub! Off the lob from Wallace. They put it up high, and he put it down hard. A rare Aaron pass from Josh Giddy on a sideline out of bounds. He is almost surgeon-like precision, usually. Raymond Liberty, that time he got stripped. There's that defense again. They hit ahead, J-Dub trying to beat everybody down the floor, and he will as he will lay it up and in. Toronto trying to run the offense here through Olenek. Olenek, his size trying to back down. Giddy fumbled it. Now Wiggins. Wiggins with speed. Hangs, floats, no. Kenrich on the follow. He's got to take what the defense gave him on that play. How about this? Take what the defense gave you that time. Aaron Wiggins. Well, he is playing some tenacious basketball. Shea bounces off of Obagi. Not a problem. SGA, that mid-range shot on the left side. He left a lot of heat on that ball at the free throw line. There's six finish, I mean, six miss of the night. As the Thunder makes another tough finish inside. Charlie go home with a $50 Sonic gift card.
Let's check in with Paris. Thanks, Chris. I spoke to Thunder assistant coach Mike Wilkes at halftime, and I asked him what was key to the turnaround and not playing with physicality in the second quarter. They really amped those things up. They applied more ball pressure, pressure got stops like they did right there, and really picked up the energy and physicality, oh. all of which will be key here in the second half, guys. Toronto would shut it at 56%. There's SGA in the pull-up. What a shot in the mid-range right on the elbow. The lead grows to 14. Uh, and SGA. Uh, yeah, a lot of the greatest to ever score the basketball. And don't forget about the Iceman, George Gerber, who's an idol to all ball players. Boy, and the Thunder catch a break. Did it were, were just fantastic scores. Now, now, obviously, Michael Jordan, you know, amazing he did it five times. But we're talking about Shea, who, who's already done it one time. He knocked down a bucket of talking here, folks. In those 30-point games, 50 on the season for SGA, just a mark of consistency. Nice play, nice touch pass, says Dort. Set it up right there for J-Dub. Nice little fast break opportunity, too. That was a big key in that second quarter for the Thunder. They flipped the script on the Raptors. Oh, nice steal. Jadup took it right away from Grady Dick. He's going to take it the other way and then show a little touch again. That time on the finger roll layup. Not only the fast break points, Michael, but the points off turnovers. 20 points off turnovers for OKC, number one in the NBA. In that category, there's another turnover by Toronto. And this should could or is it going to be a take foul? No. Okay. That second quarter alone, the Thunder had a 12 fast break points. Put that in perspective, they only got two in the first quarter, but it's a trifecta by the big man, Chet Holmgren, knocking down the three. Dignall did not like the shot. Pass inside, Jada playing defense, and then he just swatted it free. Look, he just ate up Brown inside. The kick out, Holmgren off the catch. That's good. They floated inside, and the help defender came over to snatch it away. That was Kenrich. Raptors been running through the post a lot. Well, no Olenek in the game. That's right, partner. And you're forcing them to play half-court basketball. And they can't get to their strength, and you're shrinking the floor by coughing up these turnovers, and it's creating fast break -off. Oh, and Isaiah Joe just launched outside the block for the ferocious slam. And you love it. That's a, once again a transition bucket that's coming to number is the Thunder transition points. They have 20. Oh, what a block by Chet Holmgren. Step for step on Dick. That's a, that's a block that only he can do. That, that's why he's going to be rookie of the year, folks. And on the other end, it is quickly Josh Giddy. And Mike, he denies two points on one end. I got a quiet 14 points. Trying to make it 16, and he does make it 16 on 8 out of 12 shooting. A little bit of pace on it. Brady Dick, 21 points. Oh, he fumbled that, and he fumbled the dribble, and he fumbled it right into the turnover. I'm just saying. That's all I'm saying. I'm not going to say anything else. <laughs> Desperate. There's j Duck. Nice spin into the finger roll. Finger roll? Yeah, that's right. Finger roll. Ball in the hands of J-Dub again. Mismatch here. Order defending. J-Dub finds an open man. Off the catch. Isaiah Joe in the corner. Short. Terrence right over to Chet Holgren, but he missed the bunny inside. Jason Wallace, third effort, and he drains the three. This group find an offense for the Raptors. Wara. Boy, he got caught. Off balance and on the baseline. Nowhere to go. Wallace hit the hit. He's going to get fouled. There's a deflection, and it's off the hand of Dick, right into Kenrich Williams. Turnover number 22. Thornton's going to get bumped, going to get fouled, counting. And they both happen to be on Oklahoma City. Kenrich Williams on the flare, wide open for the three, and he sticks it. 24 turnovers, 30 points off. Huge number. Hayward open, sideline three, and that's back-to-back -back triples for the Thunder. Shea able to turn the corner, but now with a little hostage dribble. The kick out to Dort. Dort got it right back. A little give and go action. Nicely done. Kenrich. The guy definitely knows what March Madness is all about, folks. It's going on right now. One of the great runs in NCAA tournament history. There is SGA. Another steal. Low with the shoulder. Sends Freeman Liberty right up the tunnel. It has been a total team effort. When you look at the numbers that this team have been able to do collectively. 
top shot blocking team, and they're going to turn you over and make things happen. Oh, and Jason Wallace was trying to line up that windmill. With their 49th win of the season, with 13 games remaining. Now, Thunder Live post game with Paris and Royce. You're on another Thunder Friday night. We'll be able to give you all the analysis.